I got fired. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Joshua Davis. And even though I promised myself I would never do one of these videos, I'm about to tell you why I left BuzzFeed. And in case you're sitting there wondering, who the f is Joshua Davis? Well, I'm the guy that did this. Three. I feel sexy right now. Hello, money, pane. Shaking, not stirring. I'm nervous. Pretty epic, right? I can't believe it's been over two years since I did my last video of BuzzFeed. So what have I been doing since then? Well, let's see. First, I produced a series for Facebook starring this guy. You can't really talk about Latino culture without mentioning telenovelas. Fernando, basta! Ya apaga tu televisión! La novela nos está matando! Then I got engaged to the love of my life. So, uh, I have a question to ask. <laughs> Link in description, but I warn you, if you watch it, you might need some tissues because it's pretty romantic. I also did some mentoring with Good City Mentors with some awesome kids out here in Los Angeles. I protested, did some traveling, and up until very recently, I played a character in one of the most popular shows on YouTube. I just can't tell you which one. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I got a brand new car. But you guys want to know why I left BuzzFeed. And to be honest, I got fired. So in my last few months at BuzzFeed, I had a manager that I was kind of butting heads with. That put me in some hot water. Then it came to a weekend shoot. I decided to shoot a little scene in the Tasty Kitchen. Now they had rules set up that you are not allowed to shoot in the Tasty Kitchen unless you have permission or you're part of the Tasty Team. Now, I was not a part of the Tasty Team, but I did not touch anything, I did not move anything, but I did go and shoot there without permission. Sure enough, the next Friday, they told me that I was fired. I was kind of known as a bit of a rule breaker when I was at BuzzFeed. I'm the type that likes to ask forgiveness rather than ask permission, but this time it definitely backfired. I was a little surprised that they fired me, but I wasn't too upset because I had plans to move on anyway. But I found out me breaking the rules and shooting in the Tasty Kitchen was actually only part of the reason why I got fired. Because one month later, almost everybody else I know at BuzzFeed was let go. See, BuzzFeed had gotten hundreds of millions of dollars invested in them, but they were not making any money at the time. So they decided to cut pretty much our entire department. At the end of the day, I have no hard feelings. I had a blast when I was working at BuzzFeed. I got to meet so many cool people and do a lot of cool things, which you guys have seen. And now I'm really excited to finally start my own YouTube channel. So this channel is going to be a mix of all the things that I love and loved doing at BuzzFeed. It's going to be some funny scripted sketches. So how are you adjusting to the workflow? All I know, if I die, I'm a motherfucking legend. There's gonna be some challenges, some couples videos, some cooking videos. Who's hungry? Definitely show you guys some of my workouts. I want this channel to be a place where you can come have fun, laugh, learn, and connect with people and connect with me because I want to connect with you guys. And there you have it why I left BuzzFeed, what I've been doing since, and what I'm gonna be doing next. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications because I'm gonna try to put out a new video every single week. Say what's up in the comments. I would love to connect with you guys. Let me know what kind of videos you wanna see me do. Until next time, peace.